a 28-year marriage ending in divorce and followed by tragedy. According to investigators, a killing spree in southeast Bakersfield ended in six deaths before the gunman, 54-year-old Javier Casares, took his own life. Authorities say he shot and killed his estranged wife, 45-year-old Petra Maribel Bolano de Casares, along with four other victims across several southeast Bakersfield locations. It appears that the uh, suspect targeted each of his victims. As investigators work to find the motive to the killings, court documents are revealing the details of the couple's divorce leading up to the shootings. It was Casares that filed for divorce in December of 2017. In court documents, Petra accuses Casares of being verbally abusive, while Casares says, quote, we're getting divorced because my wife cheated on me. He asked the judge in the case to grant him access to see Petra's text messages, a request the judge appears to have denied. The divorce was finalized in June of 2018, but recently Petra sought to rehash conditions of the divorce. On August 31st, Petra filed papers asking for child support for the couple's 17 and 10 year old children, along with spousal support from Casares, and asked that he move out of the family's southeast Bakersfield home so she and their children could move in. Court documents say that Casares had kicked Petra out as their divorce was being finalized. I know that he loved her dearly because he told me he did. Family and friends who knew the couple say they had issues in their marriage, but they never imagined this turn of events. He loved his family. Family. I, I just have a really hard time wrapping my mind around what he did. The couple's children creating a single GoFundMe account to raise money for both of their parents' funeral expenses. Meanwhile, KCSO continuing to investigate for answers in the murder of Petra and the four other victims. It appears to be there's more than just a husband and wife uh, having a fight because uh, other people were targeted. And there, there's a reason for that, and we need to find that reason. Petra and Casares were expected back here in court on October 11th to work out the details of child and spousal support. Now their six children are making arrangements for their funerals. In downtown Bakersfield, Alyssa Flores, 23 ABC.